it's just difficult having to deal with multiple fur textures. What time is it? Tawana time. T-A-W-Y-A-N-A. T-A-W-Y-A-N-A. Hey guys, I am back with another video. And I bet y'all probably looking at me like, first of all, why did you come on this camera looking like somebody's armadillo? I know, okay? I know. But that's why I'm here because I'm trying to take my hair down and I thought it would be fantastic to show you guys that um, how I clip my ends so yeah I'm gonna be taking down this luxury these luxurious braids here you know what I'm saying been having them in for about three weeks now and it's time to take them down and I need to clip my ends, so I'm going to do it with you guys. Let me tell y'all a little short little story real quick. So, as I told you guys, it's just if you've seen the live that I did, um, I started making soap, and so now I sell soap as well. And make sure you check out JanaysBeautyBars.com. Link will be in the description down below. But yeah, um, shameless plug. <laughs> Um, so we've been having so many soaping supplies come to the house and my mom has just been opening up, opening up the boxes and putting them, putting the stuff where it goes. For some reason, she thought this wonderful, wonderful box here was for soap and she opened it. Okay. She opened it and she's seen everything in it before I got a chance to see it. She, when I came home, she was like, Hey, you got a box. So you got a box with a bunch of stuff in it. I'm like, what? Yeah, it was soap box, right? It got soap stuff? No. It was this box. <laughs> it was this box. I was so excited to get this box, guys. Let me let me position this so y'all can see when I open this too. Because I want y'all to see. I want you to see. Hold on, hold on. I got on sweatpants. Don't don't mind that, okay? Don't pay no attention to the fact that that I got on sweatpants. It's none of your business. <laughs> okay, so. Oh! <laughs> so, I have a, what is this? Frill? Ain't that frill? I think that's frill. I don't think we have one of these where I live at, though. Summer ends with our refreshing, punchy, sour patch, watermelon, frill, shake. Grab one while supplies last. Okay, so I need to figure out if I have one of these because I would love to get this shake. First things first is the release. Okay, so this is a Smash Crispy. Smash Crispy. It is strawberries and cream. Hmm. Then I have Dickinson's. And it is Enhanced with Witch Hazel. And it's dip deep. It's dip. It's deep cleansing. Cleans pores. Enhanced with cooling menthol and eucalyptus to help penetrate deep into pores, extracting blemish causing dirt and oil. Ooh, honey, child, I need this. And then there was this. This is tone. And it says Brazilian glam, Brazilian nut oil, and what is that? Mm-hmm, a word that I can't pronounce, um, but it sure is a pretty bottle. I'm sure it smells delightful. Ooh. Oh, ooh, this smells good. Nourishing body wash. I will be using this, and I will be letting you guys know how I like it, okay? Then there is Shea Moisture, which I love Shea Moisture. 100% um, virgin coconut oil. It's a shimmering body lotion with coconut milk and Acadia, Acadia, Senegal, Senegal. Okay, softens and restores the skin. Absolutely love it. It's made with fair trade shea butter. Okay, I cannot wait to use this. Uh, ooh, this smells really good. Last but not least, I have a Revlon Super Lustrous Lip The Lip Gloss. Okay. And so just so y'all can see what that looks like. Boom boom boom. Get that boom boom boom. And I got that boom boom boom. Yeah, that was everything that was in my influencer box. I'm about to try this lip gloss out right now. Okay, let's try this out. Mm. 
I love how big this applicator is though. Hold up, wait a minute. Let me put some lip gloss in it. Hey, 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 hey. I really like that. And you don't need a lot to make it shine. I like it. I like it. I like it all a lot. I know y'all probably like, stop singing. Dang. Sure. But my family's the same. They wish I would stop singing, but I can't stop. I just sing all day. All day long. I'm about to try this bad boy right now before we get started. Because, you know, doing hair is very tiresome. I'm going to need a snack before I start. I need some energy. Mm. It smells like strawberry cheesecake or something. Or strawberry shortcake. Oh, and there's like legitimately, hold on, let me open this all the way, okay? There are real strawberries on it. Look at that. These ain't no fake little strawberry flavoring. It's a real strawberries, honey. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Hmm. It's pretty good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to split my hair into three parts. Side, side, back. Boom. And then <laughs> and then I'm going to wet it. Um, I'm going to wet the ends because I like to wet my ends before I um, cut them. Just to see what part is actually needed to be cut off. So, that's what I'm going to do. It's about to get real ratchet up in her. Just kidding. So, I'm going to just start on this side. Um, and I'm going to pull each braid out individually. I'm going to spray it with some water. Ow, I got water in my eye. Spray with some water and then I'm going to brush it let's see what it's looking like and then I'm going to determine what I need to cut off so as you guys can see this is what it's looking like um I'm probably just going to cut like right right there if you guys can see I'm going to cut it like right there just like that Try to determine where I'm gonna cut it at and my ends actually are not too too bad like most of the time I like to do it like when I wet it because I can tell which part it really needs to be cut off like what may be damaged because it doesn't curl up correctly um, but these this one actually isn't too bad that first one was a little worse than the um than this one but I'm probably just gonna cut like right here boom just like that when I move you move just like that and then on to the next yeah my hair texture is really just all over the place um, I don't try to define it I don't try to label it as a b c d e f g because <laughs> it really is I really just can't tell like some places it may be a Q and other places it's a a B. <laughs> I know it's supposed to think it's a Q, guys. I'm not slow, but I am at the same time. Ooh, yeah. So anybody else, um, when you're like going through or going past a um when you're on an escalator or when you're going past like one of those drains or even when you walk onto an elevator, do you like grab your grip your phone like super super tight? Because I sure know I do. I grab my phone super tight like you ain't falling today. I ain't finna lose you today. I do the same with my keys too. I'll grip it like super super tight because if they fall down that hole, it's a done deal. So I just try to make sure I don't give it the opportunity to. So the front of my hair doesn't curl like the back does so I mean I know how the curl goes I know how my curls look or so are supposed to look see like like this from like here down that all needs to go because that's not how my hair is supposed to be curling it, it needs to go it's just for dangling 
it need to go but like in the back I'll show you guys some in the back in just a second but in the back the curls are a lot tighter and so I know how those are supposed to look as well it's just difficult having to deal with multiple fur textures here's one from the back as you can see already like the curl is like a lot tighter already but let me spray it I'm just not trying to spray the camera okay and this water is just running down my arm the way that curl is popping back though I see you pop that curl pop that curl okay so curl is like super super tight but this little piece down her that little piece needs to go hold on Ooh. let me just make sure but yeah the rest of that is good to go I'm gonna go ahead and cut the rest of my hair not cut the rest of my hair I'm going to go ahead and clip the rest of my ends and then I'll be back well, I got this piece over here looking like a puff Cheeto I am finally done cutting um, clipping all the ends Clipping all the ends. Do, 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 do. Now it is going to be time for me to take my hair down. And for um, for me, I find it so much easier to take my hair down after I've went ahead and clipped all of my ends. My ends are not like 100% clipped, but they were clipped enough for it to be um, a smoother process when I take my hair down. And when I go to wash my hair, um, my hair won't be as rough on the ends because, you know, yeah that is the end of this video if you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up if you're not already make sure you subscribe down below and make sure you leave a comment if you're feeling frisky let me know what other kind of videos you would like to see me do um be prepared for some soaping videos coming up some more hair videos what other kind of hair videos would you guys like to see um thank you guys so much i love you and i'll see you next video bye